then visible light is used in treat treatment of jaundice for example when in premature babies or new newborn babies they are a bit sometimes they are a bit pale in color why pale in color because of the presence of excess of bilirubin bilirubin is the yellow pigment present in bruises so uh, they are placed inside incubators inside incubators where they are lit with the blue light so what blue light does it breaks down the bilirubin and that break uh, the break version of bilirubin is excreted from the body in, uh, in the form of urine or uh, uh, this sweat right this how they the blue light is used for the treatment of jaundice in babies then x radiography what is x radiography this image x radiography means taking the x rays the all of us must have already done our x rays for some part of our body because it is very common these days to get x ray for uh, break up bones or uh, if for fracture in bones right this particular image was the first image it was in 1985 so this was the first uh, uh, a uh, first successful version of x-ray and this image is the result of 15 minute exposure of x-rays on the human hand actually the scientist who did this this is his wife's hand and um, that time it was 15 minute exposure these days the exposure of x-rays on the human body is not even more than 5 millisecond right then we know about how x-rays work right this is see the difference in image Th those back in the days we had x-rays like this and now we have x-rays like this right so how uh, this technique this technology has evolved then computer tomography image that is uh, obviously ct scan ct scan gives a virtual uh, details of the tissues and other stuff collaborated with bone so this is all computer generated right this is second this image is showing this second metastatal bone and um, usually football players are injured in that bone this is this image is showing the crack right in a crack in this pelvical joint <clears throat> then x rays and gamma rays they are used to cure cancers how by by because when human body is exposed to uh, gamma radiation the very high energy radiations they <clears throat> kill the cancer cells how cancer cells see cancer occurs when a cell divides too quickly the dividing cells become a tumor which can damage surrounding tissue or spread to the rest of the body that this is a very simple explanation of how cancer is done so more and more number of cells increasing this is what cancer is about so when x rays or other radiation can damage the dna cells they can kill they can also kill them right that is why radioactive can be dangerous but cells which are dividing rapidly are more likely to be killed so that is why when we use x-rays to kill the rapidly dividing cancer cell we must also ensure that the healthy tissue is unaltered or untouched right or undamaged <clears throat>